Hello, thank you for watching, for clicking on this video. I hope that you are able to get some value out of this video. So, in order for that to happen, I just want to talk about uh, learning Spanish. I don't know why is the reason that you want to learn Spanish. I think... Um, Maybe because you want to travel or you have been traveling and whether you were able to have some conversations but not in the depth that you wanted to or you were not able to communicate at all in the way that you uh, which you are going to be able to communicate next time. So in either way, I'm not going to be able to make you fluent in 10 minutes. Uh, in fact, you are the one who will do the work in order to reach your fluency goals. But I want to express to you that this channel will have different videos that will help Spanish learners become fluent and not only become fluent but improve no matter where you are that you can improve in your language goals so just like if you wanted to improve in any other area you sometimes go to somebody that knows more about that as a native spanish speaker I was uh, born and raised in a Spanish-speaking country, but on the other hand, I also was around people who spoke other languages like English, and I was so curious and so interested in learning that language to be able to communicate with them. And so I, I, I can relate perhaps to your feelings of wanting to learn to speak to understand those sounds. Uh, I remember when I was younger in in my 16, 16 years, I was 16 years old and I was in a car with some people that were speaking in another language uh, that was English but I, I, I was not fluent at that point in my life. And everybody was laughing and I was like, what if they're talking about me? Or like, they're just laughing and I would like to be, <coughs> I would like to be able to be laughing with them. But I was not laughing at all. And from that moment on, I was like, I want to become fluent in many languages. However, I did realize that uh, for whatever reason, maybe I didn't have, with the tools that I had at that time in my life, which was not much, I didn't even think of the possibility of getting a tutor online. Uh, not that it was impossible, but it was not something that I didn't have money for tutoring. I didn't even have regular access to the internet. So with the limited resources that I had, the only thing I I realized that if I focused in many languages, I was not making enough progress or <clears throat> or the progress that I wanted to make. So I said sometime after that that I wanted to within one year become fluent in English and we'll see after that if I wanted to to start learning other languages or what but I did decided that okay I want to make progress in a language so I'm gonna focus on English so I did that and I, I don't regret it I am happy uh, that I made that decision I've been able to make so many friends have work opportunities because of speaking English and also speaking Spanish and uh, yeah I just had like so many good friendships and good experiences and I would like you to be able to, to do the same. 
have amazing friends, experiences, even communicating, learning stories, culture, and different things that is possible when we speak different languages. So, um, so this video, I am basically uh, putting myself out there so that you know that you can um, follow on the journey and, and see how I share with you all <coughs> uh, some experiences about um, personal that I have that I have been able to 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 learn to enjoy because of speaking a, a different language but also I want to be able to support others that are learning Spanish and I don't have like a lot of things written or planned for this video because I wanna I wanted to exactly make it like very natural, more like in a conversation. So I imagine you might ask a question like, why would you like to follow or subscribe or come back to this channel? And so I will say what comes to mind. That is that I am very passionate about learning languages in general. But I do have another passion, passion, which is the one of teaching. I enjoy so much when somebody that is talking with me or somebody that I meet and say, hey, you know, I'm learning Spanish or, or either language, uh, English, or even like I'm learning another language that I don't know, like Hebrew or uh, Chinese and... I am so passionate about seeing what they're doing, how they're doing it, uh, discussing strategies. Hey, do you know, like, what can you do or what have you been doing that works? Or um, many times I meet people that say, like, oh, I really, really want to. But, you know, I haven't been able to. I have been using this app for years, but, like, I'm not able to have a conversation. And so... Uh, I have been working with uh, students, people interested in learning Spanish and English for some time. So I have had a long time relationships. I mean, long for me, two years. Uh, and, and I enjoy so much seeing their progress. I, I enjoy talking with people. Right now, I am currently working with people one-on-one. -on -one. I enjoy so much one-on-one -on -one lessons. Um, my goal for me, which it may sound weird to you that I may say this. If you have a session with me, I don't have the goal of teaching you a lot of words or a lot of phrases just focusing on you for that session like you're you hire me for this session and then i want you to take the most out of this session and then uh bye bye your problem whether you benefit of not or not that's your problem i don't have that mindset kind of like you hire me for this hour and bye i did my job bye bye I, I, I don't have that mindset, which is, <clears throat> so don't get me wrong, if you hire me, uh, or any tutor, I guess, you will be wanting to get the most out of that hour, but for some reason, and, and, and any good tutor would like you to get the most out of your time with them, and that's certainly something that I strive to do. But in order to do that, I focus much more beyond that hour, which means that you will probably most likely not become fluent in one hour. But the only reason I'm saying this is because, is because you're a person 
and you have a schedule of things, you know, whether you retire and you have your own projects or you have a disease, you have limited energy or you're going to school or to college and or you know if you're a child you there's a lot of things that you have to do like playing with your video games and your friends you're not always gonna be learning Spanish for the most part some people would be very passionate and learning every day but I'm saying that because I want you to know that the last uh, for some time already for the last I don't know few years maybe three or so years or more I I have been focusing on helping a person to start to work with me and to finish when I say finish is to progress to progress like if we're working for three months or for one month or or, or for more than that I am not focusing on this session, I'm focusing on you and making progress so that at the end of the time that you are not going to work with me any longer, you feel like, okay, not only you told me 300 phrases that I could have learned from, from Google or from reading a book or something, but actually, by meeting you, easy, you can call me easy or Israel, whatever. Uh, by, by, by meeting you, you know, I was already motivated, but I was able to learn what could I do to progress. What could I do to study on my own? Or you motivated me, you gave me assignments, you gave me support, you were basically like a like a coach of a sport or a gym like a personal trainer you were somebody who supported me who cheered me up when i was struggling who gave me uh, uh, strategies uh, who talked with me about problems that i was having so that i could improve uh, problems that i was having we discuss how to overcome them. We did overcome them. Uh, we we enjoy. We spend time. So basically, since I met you, I have been able to progress on my language, on my Spanish, so much. Thank you so much for that. And so that is much more than just. Uh, for instance, I can go into YouTube and watch a lesson for one hour and I'll learn things but it is different for me to say you know my I know this guy and that you know I met like at school or whatever or online you know like now with technology talking one-on-one -on -one, it's like you you're knowing the person you you're knowing who you're talking to and saying you know, since I've been talking to him, it's been so helpful. I received so much support and, and now I'm doing better. I'm doing better because he really cares. He's, he is interested in helping me. He gave me some nice suggestions. Uh, he cheered me up, but also uh, <coughs> patiently explained to me certain things that I needed to know that I didn't know. And now I know what it's like to, to, I know what I need to do to, to be able to be fluent. I, I feel more confident. Um, I have progress from where I was. Now it's just a matter of continuing. So that is my wish. So if you come here for other videos, my wish is that you will be able to share with me what would you like what do you struggle with and how can I help you and I will be happy to answer those things in the questions and if there is anything I can do please share it on the comments I will be happy to review them and to express ways in future videos that will be of, 
of help for you. And I'll be so happy to know that I've contributed so that you can hablar español. Okay, bye. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Ah, ha, 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 ha